This is Code Combat. I'm currently working on their Web Development 2 course, Level 21 Precision Coloring. Goals. Give dot color 5 a background color using RGB, which is red, green, blue. Give dot color 6 a background color using RGB as well. RGB is a function. It takes up to three numbers as arguments. Arguments are these things. And think of it as pixels, right? The first one being red, blue, and then green. And the number 0, meaning 0 red element for the first number, to 250, which is like max-ish. Right? Same for blue. I mean, same for green. Same for blue. Let's see. What should we be doing? Set the background color using RGB. Okay, so I can just type in background like they have right above us. Color and then RGB and then whatever we want. We can kind of test it out. Um, let's see. I'm going to try 83, uh, 0, and 155, semicolon. Oh, that must be purple. <laughs> All right, and so I'm going to again now background hyphen color, okay, red, green, blue, RGB. And so let's see, what if it has for red, um, uh, 150, for blue it's going to have none, and for, I mean, for green it has zero, um, and then for blue, oh no, let's have 150, won't this be yellow maybe? Oh, that's kind of ugly, but hey, it's a color. So that's really cool, and we can always color things like this. And it colors stuff with the class tag. So dot means class, right? So everything in between style and style is our CSS. We're coloring the stuff below it, the HTML, and we're using the dot color six, and that means there's a class, yep, right there. Great, let's uh, keep going.